This I wanna nail sports to the one Top blog out of the YouTube channel No matter which sports here we got it covered Subscribe and hit the notification bell What's up my wonderful peeps? Sports to the bone here again man Shout out to all the viewers Subscribers and the followers Big up on yourself Alright my viewers and subscribers So by now I think most persons would be aware that a couple of our players on tour over there in Pakistan, they actually tested positive for the big C. So that means, you know, they will be sitting out the tour. So an already thin squad will get even thinner. So what I'm going to be doing, my viewers and subscribers, are going to be reading the article that is on the CWI uh, website explaining what has happened. And, you know, I also have a next story with Andre Russell. He has arrived to play in the Big Bash League, but there are a whole lot of um, stipulations that he, that he has to follow. He actually played um, in a game, I think it was yesterday, and he wasn't allowed to high five to celebrate to um, to stay in the same space with the team with his with his teammates all sorts of things. So we're gonna be looking at that. But before we go any further, just gonna ask you guys to go right ahead and to subscribe to the channel if you are yet to subscribe. Also make sure that you turn on the post notification bell. So once we upload a video, you can be notified. And also please feel free to like and also drop a comment all right so we're going into the first story here we are seeing on the cwi website it um where the headline is saying chase cottrell and myers unavailable for t20 international series in pakistan after the big c test came back positive Right, and you know why we say big C on, on YouTube, and we say big C, it's a substitute for that thing. You understand? You know YouTube already. So let me read, let me read some of what is, is being said here. So they say following a PCR test administered on arrival in Pakistan, Cricket West Indies can confirm that four members of the West Indies touring party have tested positive for the big C. And will now undergo a period of self isolation. Now, left arm pacer Shell and Cottrell, all rounders Ruston Chase and um, Kyle Myers, along with a non coaching member of the team management unit, returned positive tests in Karachi and will therefore be unavailable to participate in the upcoming Pakistan series. Now, all four members are fully. Um, they, 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 they were fully joked or they got their job and are without uh, major symptoms. You understand now? Johnny Grave um, is quoted as saying, and I quote, our, our, our arrival testing protocols in Pakistan have confirmed four um, big C positives. These were confirmed whilst the players and staff were still in room isolation. So despite the significant setback, to our preparation plans we are confident that the tour can continue as everyone else returned negative um tests right no the um, negative tests on their arrival to um to pakistan no the risk for big c infection is impossible to remove completely from a cricket tour no in spite of that fact many of our players have been living in biosecure bubbles almost continuously since before the cpl it goes on to say this um this unusual loss of three players from our squad will seriously impact our team <laughs> hey these people funny you know um prepar team preparations but the rest of the squad are in good spirits and will begin training today ahead of our first game on monday so that is what our um our, our boss of CWI, Johnny Grave, had to say. All right, so the, the, the article continues and it says, All four individuals will remain isolated from the rest of the West Indies squad and are now under the care and supervi supervision of the team physician, Dr. Akshay Man Singh. Now, they will remain in isolation for 10 days and until they return a negative PCR test result. Um, the 3T20 series starts on Monday. Um, December 13 and will be played in the Karachi National Stadium. 
All right, and let me just go back over the schedule in quick for you guys. So the T20 International starts at 6 p.m. local time. Hey man, um, that, that would make it around about 9 a.m. Eastern Caribbean time and 8 a.m. Jamaica time. All right, ODI start at 1 p.m. local time, which would make it 4 a.m. Eastern Caribbean time and 3 a.m. Jamaica time. So the first um, T20 goes off tomorrow, which would be December the 13th. Well, yeah, 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 I think December the 13th. The next one would be um, December the 14th, the second. Um, yeah, that's the T20 in Karachi. Then December 16th, they will have the third. December 4th, um, the ODIs will start on December 18th. The second one on the twentieth of December, and the second one, the um, the third and final one, on um, the twenty second of December. So there you have it, my viewers and subscribers. Those are the players that actually returned um, the, the test. So Catrell, Myers, and Chase. Um, so we are going to have to make do without those guys. You know the the funny part about it is when they said that um, it, you know, the removal of these guys hamper their preparation. I, I, I can agree because you want you want as much competition in the squad as possible. And those guys were almost um you could almost guarantee that guarantee that those guys would have played. You know, um Rastan Chase, Myers and Cottrell. You understand? So it's it's real sad though. It's real sad. I, I don't know. I, I am hoping that these guys don't use this as um as any sort of excuse though. We need to zoom in on the players that will that will actually play. So whoever will play, we need to zoom in on them and make sure we scrutinize the thing good. All right. So let us let us move on to what Mr. J. Ross, who was unavailable to, to tour Pakistan, is what's happening with him. So he's currently um he's there, he's now in the BBL. And I see a headline here. I am taking this one from the Zero Wicket website. All right, and it says strict conditions revealed for Russell's BBL start. I remember he, he, he was added late, you know. So high fives are among the things. Well, the article starts and says high fives are among, among the things that Melbourne Stars, Star Arm um, Stars players are banned from doing with star import Andre Russell after only arriving in Australia last week. Now, the West Indian, along with um, Ahmed, is still under a strict set of um, Big C rules. According to the Telegraph, um, the, the two the, the duo are said to, be, um, said to be given their own private dressing room. All of this is designed to speed up their avail availability while still um, adhering to Cricket Australia's guidelines for overseas players. Now, the most um, stringent of these guidelines is the strict no physical contact rule. This will mean that any form of celebration will need to be done at safe distance. <laughs> Boy, this must be funny. Um, while the rules seem slightly over the top, they are designed to ensure that the BBL can continue safely without the overseas um, players in the, comp um, you know, the, the, in the competition um, causing any issues in terms of the protocols and things. Alright, so there, there we see Russell and, and Ahmed, those guys will not be allowed to celebrate with the team. So you cannot run and hug them up or high five them or tap them or you know anything of the sort and they will be given their own dressing room they are using i gather they are also going to be using a different entrance to get to the ground so a whole lot of different things just to make sure that um they, they keep the competition going but at the end of the day you know, my viewers and subscribers you have to do what you have to do if you want your 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 thing to work out you know so um, these are just some measures that they have to, to work with and I am certain that they would have confirmed these with the players before they would have um they would have signed and say, Okay, I am alright with it. You know, I am I am just happy that he's available to play and <laughs> and he's there enjoying himself. So yeah, my viewers and subscribers, we, we, we're going to leave this one right here for now. But um, just to say, if you made it to the end of the video, you can just type it in the comment section and say, made it to the end. And, you know, I, I am planning to go live this evening so we can discuss the squad that will be used in tomorrow's game. So just go and big up on yourself, my peeps, and enjoy the Sunday. Make sure you guys enjoy the Sunday. Rice and peas or peas and rice, you know, and hey, whatever you guys having. So just have a wonderful day and we'll chat with you more. Zin, big up on yourself.